What's up everyone? With summer fast approaching and rumours beginning to circle already, of course we are here to talk about everything to do with Big Brother 23. So join me guys as we begin to dissect and analyse everything that we've heard so far about Big Brother 23. So welcome to your Big Brother update. Right before we get started folks, please don't forget to hit the subscribe button if you are new around here and also click the like button as well as the bell icon to get notified every single time a brand new upload goes live on the channel. Okay folks, so jumping right in, I'll give you a brief overview of the rumours that we have heard so far. So we're going to talk about some casting rumours, we're going to talk about a potential start date, which is obviously fantastic information to have this early in the year. Uh, I say information, it's a rumour at this point obviously. And also some twists which seem very, very exciting as well. Um, I'm going to talk through them. Obviously you guys in the comments let me know what you think of the twist, if you think that there's, you know, there's any truth to them. Just all that sort of stuff guys. I just can't wait to, to be chatting Big Brother with everybody again, so just drop every single thing you're thinking in the comments because I love to have the conversation with you guys as well. But let's get started with the first lot of rumours. Now, just before I do reveal the first rumour, um, this source is from a Twitter account, just so everybody knows, and they have shown to be quite a reliable source in the past. Uh, most of the things that they have said about things that were going to happen with Big Brother 22 did turn out to be quite right, and they cover other shows as well. And uh, there's quite a lot of um, truth to, to, to the rumours that, that, uh, that do end up surfacing. So, uh, yeah, let's, let's, uh, let's stick with the first one. So, CBS is planning an all-newbie season, guys, so don't respect any, expect any returnees this year. Obviously, Big Brother 22 was full on just returnees all over it was all star season but this year expect a full cast of new players it's going to be 16 players as usual which is very very exciting um and yeah so that's that's the first one um which i think is totally believable 16 house guests all new totally a believable rumor there i'm excited to just know i think just uh, hearing just stuff like that even as basics i mean we'd all assume as big brother fans that we're getting 16 brand new house guests but when you just hear little things like that you just get so so excited and um yeah i mean uh, you know summer is just around the corner and you know it's weird how you know time just creeps up on you and you're like oh my god it's it's nearly here you know it's it has nearly been a year since big brother 22 all stars uh you know was was on um obviously it started a bit later last year but it's getting towards that time where it's summer again and uh, and big brother's gonna kick off but yes folks that's the first rumor uh nothing too too surprising there but it's going to be an all newbie cast with 16 house guests now this is a really exciting one guys so reports are that cbs are planning the start date for big brother 23 to be june 30th and i was quite surprised when i saw this because i'm like oh my god that is not long away at all you know we're at what april 9th 10th now uh, april 10th and uh i don't even know why to think there but it's april 10th now so you know it's just over two months away which is really crazy to think that we could be doing all these updates again it, oh, i'm just so so excited i'll contain my excitement but i'm sure you guys are excited as well to know that big brother could be coming back on in just over two months which is just the most amazing thought ever i can't wait for it if june 30th is the date that they are going to go with thank you very much because it's not long away at all and i can't wait uh to, to start covering big brother again but yes um i, I think uh, usually it would it does start sort of back end of june and, and beginning of july so i would say that's a probable date and uh, definitely one i'm happy with <laughs> Now for some twists, guys. Now, obviously, we know that there's no truth to these yet, but they are a rumour. But the first twist that we are going to discuss that CBS are considering for Big Brother 23 is called the bribe twist. Now, this would entail a competition in which the house guests would compete in and one person would win $10,000. That's a lovely amount of money right there. And they would be able to use that $10,000 to uh, to bribe people in the game anonymously to earn game favours. So, you know, this would be done through the diary room. So, you know, say if the, somebody was the HOH and somebody won this 10k they would then be able to put this bribe into the dr into the diary room and then uh, and say you know i want to pitch to the, to the hoh that i will give them seven point five thousand dollars if they don't put me on the block now uh it's a very interesting concept it, you know you could ask any game favors you know maybe to you know throw the veto competition you could ask them to um just to think of anything it could be even just something as simple as you know maybe they don't have to they don't pick them to go on slop just something totally minuscule but something it could also be massive as well and obviously i would imagine you would bribe with a bit more money if you wanted a bigger game favor whereas like you know maybe not going on a slop cost maybe five hundred dollars or, or one thousand dollars so uh, I quite like this idea, to be honest. It will add uh, another layer of complexity to the game. And uh, I think it'll be really, really interesting to see, you know, are people really there for the money or are people there for the game? Because that will really show the true colours of di many different house guests and what their, their actual intentions are. Um, and, you know, I think, it, it, you know, there's so many situations in Big Brother where your back is totally against the wall and there's nothing you can do. But having this bribe twist is really going to allow, you know, other options in the game. So when you think, you know, somebody goes in the block, you're like, OK, this is happening right now. So... 
I can't really think of a scenario in, in past Big Brother, but there's been plenty where, you know, HOH nominates two people and, you know, and everyone, the whole audience is just thinking there is no way either of those guys are getting off the block or doing anything. But, uh, you know, this could change now because this person could, you know, bribe someone and say, take me off the block for for 10k and then you know boom i mean there's there's an incentive there whereas you know when you say take me off the block for nothing they're like no i'm gonna keep it on the block because you're not giving me anything but ten thousand dollars is a hell of a lot of money so people will probably succumb to that and, and it'll it'll make loads of different connections in the game it won't just be this a solid six or a solid eight that are working together there'll be so many different sort of connections that'll be weaving around the house because people want that money money is such a, a big motivator and and people will take that just so uh just so they can be richer <laughs> it's, it's it's as simple as that so i really do like the idea of this bribe twist and uh it'll be really interesting to see if it does play out um let me know what you think guys in the comments of the bribe twist we've got one more twist to discuss but as of now the bribe twist is the first one um let me know what you think i quite like it i'm uh, i'm interested to see what you guys think now, the second twist rumor that is going around is something called the Veto Multiplier. Now, this should be very, very interesting to see how this one plays out. Yet again, another layer of complexity added to the game. So, this would allow somebody to take off multiple people off the block. So, you know, obviously two people off the block uh, when they have the power of Veto. Now, this is something, you know, that is going to be a total game changer because... You know, when one person comes off, it's usually destined that, unless there's a back door in place, it's usually destined that the person who was on the block in the first place will go home. But if they take two people off the block, then it's essentially the weak restart and, and you know, those nominees have got to be made again, but there obviously won't be another veto comp after that. So it's really going to blow up the game. It really is going to be um, a very interesting game. And I think, uh, you know, quite a lot of these past couple of years of Big Brother, it's been very sort of just game set match when you're on the block. It's like the HRH nominates you and the plan is we send this person out and this person and ends up going out and I think CBS themselves are probably thinking we need to mix this up a bit and that's why they've added the bribe twist potentially anyway and that's why they've added the veto multiplier because then things won't be as I guess predictable and you know things can can blow up a bit more because literally with the veto multiplier and the bribe twist the week could literally start one way and end the exact opposite way than what you thought which is going to be incredible to watch you know week in week out we'll be guessing who's actually going to be going rather than just saying oh it's going to be this person this week then this person then this person's going to win the game it's just it's a, it's a very exciting thought because you know just having one of those twists even if it was just one just the bribe twist or the veto multiply by themselves that will mix up the game a lot but having them both together kaboom this is going to be very 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 exciting i like the idea of the veto multiplier i like the idea of the bribe twist i've got nothing to complain about uh yet we'll say yet there but um i, I do like both the ideas let me know guys what you think of the veto multiplier do you like the idea of having two twists in together uh, do you want some more twists or just no twists whatsoever let me know guys that is all of your updates for today, folks. I thoroughly hope you all enjoyed watching. And uh, yeah, I'm just really, really excited about these rumors myself, to be honest, right now, guys. And I don't know, you know, obviously, we all know what a rumor is. We don't know if there's any truth to it, but there also might be. But as a Big Brother fan, it's just really, really awesome to speculate and discuss what might, might be and what might not be. There's just you know that's even big brother itself you know when you're in the house you're always second guessing stuff and trying to figure stuff out and it's exactly what we're doing outside the house trying to figure out what's going on with big brother 23 but i mean i'm very very happy with those rumors i hope june 30th is the start date because that is you know as i said it's only over two months away which ain't long at all and uh yeah let's Let's get the season started. I can't wait. And, uh, you know, guys, let me know uh, in the comment section. Hit me up what you think of all these rumors. Do you like the bribe twist? Do you like the veto multiplier? What do you think of the cast being all newbies? Did you want returnees? Did you want uh, a later start date, an earlier start date? There's just so much to discuss, and I can't wait to discuss it with you guys in the comment section, as always. But, folks, I will say thank you so, so much, as always, for watching my videos. I will obviously be back here in the summer, and, uh, you know, when any other rumors surface, I'll be back on here to discuss straight away. Um, I just love talking big brother and um you know it's just awesome to to chat with you guys as fans as well you know as a fellow fan a big brother it's just the most amazing thing ever to to chat amongst fellow fans but guys thank you so so much for watching i really genuinely do appreciate you all coming back to watch time and time again it means the world to me uh, i hope you're all st staying safe and well out there uh, and keeping healthy but don't forget to like share comment and subscribe do all of that stuff but until your next big brother update i've been your host tom vasey good night